what's up guys? It's Arlen Woods with Retro Styles back at you again and man it's an awesome holiday season. We're days away from celebrating the birth of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and opening up presents, eating a bunch of food and having fun with the family and it's just awesome. Well, what do I say? Merry Christmas to everyone. I don't say happy holidays because they are happy but it's Merry Christmas because Christ is a reason for this season. So today what we're celebrating is one of the very few RPGs for Sega Genesis and I just recently got into this maybe no less than a few months ago man it's so awesome and it's good to see that Sega had a good market for RPGs if they would have really kept going they could have went strong with these so this title right here and yes I still do have it in the box and the manuals on the inside which is really rare to find these so this to me is a gem all in itself uh, this one's called Shining in the Darkness. It's actually an RPG, a role-playing game. Like I said, very rare, very hard to find, very awesome game title. You can see, like, still in the box, still in the box, original. And today we'll open this up right here, and we're going to get started. So, we're going to start unboxing. I use the term unboxing because a lot of people, some of the new uh, millennials don't know what a cartridge is. And they're barely learning what they are. And they don't know where the start was, was from cartridges. Now they go up with CDs and downloads. And it's all good because we still have fun. But this is how we like to have fun, the classic way. So, we're going to use my original... Sega right here, it's my Sega Genesis 16-bit with my Sega CD combo. So we're going to plug it in and have some fun. And yes, I might even blow on this cartridge. <coughs> hey, first shot. Awesome. I don't know if you guys can see, but it's pretty awesome. Okay, you see old grandpa right there. Let me turn this up for you guys. Okay, I'm going to continue. I have played this. There's three different ones. There's Lloyd26, which I want to thank my, my cousin Lloyd. He's the one that hooked me up with all this stuff. It was a good haul. And, he was just so awesome to do all this for me. He knows I'm into retro gaming. It does like it does with typical RPGs. I see the speed of the letters and where would you like to go? And 1991. See what I mean? Look how awesome that is. See, uh, Sega could have had a market for. RPGs, but who knows? Alright, we're gonna rip right into the castle. Here we go. So you could go into the tavern, the armorer, the alchemist, where you could get spells, you can go into the shrine. Or you can exit. See, look, it has all your MP, your HP, your LV, which is a, your level, which is your magic power, your hit points. All right, so now we've entered. Okay, this is where the real deal comes in. Okay. And it, oh, here we go. Slimes. Okay. This is where you can attack the slimes. Well, we got one. The slimy oozes. Unlike the other RPGs, let me turn this down a bit. Unlike the other RPGs where it pauses and you get all your points and then you keep going, after the battle, you're done. It's really quick and that's what I really like about this. So my recommendation to you, if you can get your hands on this gem right here, 
Shining in the Darkness by Sega Genesis. I mean, it's worth every penny. I mean, thankfully for my cousin, he gave me a big old haul full of games for a really good price. And, and see, look, just like I told you, comes with the manual and everything. And advertises for Fantasy Star. You can get your hands on that one. It's awesome, too. So, Sega Genesis, 16-bit cartridge. You guys, this is Arlen Woods with Retro Styles. Wishing you guys a very Merry Christmas. You guys be a great, awesome version of you. You guys have a wonderful day.